Hey guys, this is Michael from the Piano Technician Academy, and today I'm going to talk to you about pin blocks. So a lot of people don't know this, but the tuning pins that we turn to tune the piano, they actually don't go into that cast iron plate. They go through the plate into a piece of wood. Now this pin block came off of a really crappy piano. Somebody rebuilt it. This is not something you should ever, ever, ever put into a piano. This thing even has cardboard in it. Um, but as you can see, it's also cracked right along here, all the way across. And then they've also put a bunch of plugs in here. This stuff, this liquid right here, is most likely some sort of glue or something that's making the wood swell. But this pin block came out of a piano that a rebuilder rebuilt for a customer. Somebody charged somebody to do this to their piano. And it was pulled out, and now we use it as a prop to just kind of show you guys how pin blocks work. But basically these tuning pins, if you look very closely, they have just a very, very, very fine thread on them. And they thread directly into this block, just like this. But as you can imagine, if this crack was here and this pin keeps tightening in and in and in, it's going to open up this crack and this pin is going to slip, just like a screw would. And now the piano is untunable. And you can see whoever is working on this piano doped all these pins all along this crack in hopes of fixing it. In fact, over here, they even put in plugs. So that is how a pin block works. This is a really, really bad one, but hopefully this kind of explains to you guys um, how piano tuning works and why a pin block is a big important part of the piano and why a cracked one is basically the kiss of death for a piano until it's replaced. But thanks for watching, guys. If you have any questions, always shoot me an email at michael at pianotechnicianacademy.com.